Hi everyone in this video i'm just explaining how i fix my slanting tree problem in godot normally in godot when we use multi mesh it just places the source mesh on the uh, target surface uh, aligned to the normals of the target mesh so the problem is that uh, when we use trees uh, or some other objects it looks slanted on the slopes uh, like a hilly terrain earlier i had fixed this uh, issue uh, using another method but that was uh, difficult and was not perfect like this method and now you can see by default uh, godot places the multi meshes like this so it's uh, all uh, slanted on the curves Now I'm just showing the custom compiled version of Godot uh, in which I have uh, done an easy fix uh, for this problem. So in this uh, custom compiled version uh, when you use multi mesh uh, it places the objects uh, on the target surface vertically. You can see all the trees are uh, looking upwards uh, in this one and you can even uh, uh, put it back like the old Godot way aligning to the normals. I think they should have um, done it this way uh, in the Godot uh, release version because many people who cannot code like me needs to use this multi mesh without any coding. you can go to the github page of godon and you can download the source code of any version you want you can find out how to compile godon for your operating system uh, on the website uh, once you have downloaded the um, source code uh, go to the editor folder and you can find a plugins folder inside that and when you scroll down you can find the multi mesh uh, plugin cpp file uh, now you have to scroll down uh, and somewhere in the middle uh, of the script you can find uh, how the normals are calculated so what you have to do is to um, disable the normal values so earlier what i did was to multiply the normals with a zero this actually solved the problem but uh, another problem i faced was uh, i was not able to uh, get the uh, default slanting objects uh, then i found uh, the uh, tilt random value uh, starts from zero uh, and goes up to 1 So I decided to try this uh, random tilt value to multiply the normals. It really worked the way I wanted. Uh, you can even change the number of multi meshes uh, if you want. Now just save this file and uh, you can compile the Godot. I hope uh, this uh, video will be helpful for some Godot users. Thank you.